everybody, this is Lou. Welcome to my channel. I'm coming to you guys with yet another Apple Watch video. So uh, sit back, enjoy, and let's get into it. So on launch day of the Series 4 Apple Watch, Apple announced an ECG feature that will be coming later within the year. And that feature is finally here. So for those of you guys that don't know what an ECG is, is essentially monitoring one's heartbeat. Um, these tests often tell you if you guys have a regular heart rate, an irregular heart rate, or if you're at risk for AFib, and just other things that are very important to health. So for those people that are very health conscious, this feature is definitely a welcome. So now that this feature is finally on the Apple Watch, um, I will show you guys basically how to set it up. Um, you do that in the Apple Watch app on your phone. Um, so you go into the Apple Watch app and then you click on the heart icon. And then from there, you'll see um, options to either set up the ECG feature or set up heart rate notifications. Um, I recommend you do both. And setting up is actually very easy. All you really have to do is answer a question or two and I believe just put in your birth date. Um, I already did this step, so um, my screen's gonna look a tad bit different. I have it annotated, annotated somewhere over here. Um, so it's gonna look a tad bit different than how your prompt would look, but essentially after you guys set up the ECG um, in the Apple Watch app, um, you can, you're now ready to take your ECG. So taking an ECG is actually very straightforward. All you would really do is just go into the Apple Watch. There's going to be a dedicated app. It's going to be a brand new app for the ECG app. And then from there, you click into the app and then you just basically press the digital crown for 30 seconds and then it reaches your heartbeat. So during that 30 seconds, you'll see your heartbeat in real time. It's actually really cool. I know you guys like my little heartbeat. <laughs> But no, you'll see your heart rate in, in real time, and it's actually really cool to watch. And then after the test is done, it tells you, okay, your heart rate is normal, or your heart rate is abnormal, you're at risk for AFib or whatever. Um, you do get a little mini summary on your Apple Watch, but then a more detailed summary goes straight to your phone. You get a notification as soon as it's done, and it goes straight to your phone. And then from there, you can look at a more detailed report of your ECG. The best part about this app is that as soon as you do get that uh, report on your phone, you are able to send a PDF to your doctor if you need to. And you know your doctor can probably explain more of the ECG test to you. So I do believe that that's a very welcome feature and I applaud Apple for doing that. We'll leave a quick disclaimer for you guys. This app cannot detect heart attacks. It cannot detect strokes. So if you guys do feel something is wrong with you, please visit a doctor. Um, the app does say that too. I just, I just want to warn you guys again, you know, do not rely solely on this test. If you feel bad, go to a doctor. This all disclaimers aside, I do believe that this is a very, very welcomed feature within the Apple Watch. Um, Apple's just doing something to make the best smartwatch ever even better, and it's definitely welcome. It works. I'm. It. It's just something that, especially if you're really, really health conscious, it's just an amazing tool to have right at your wrist. So guys, this was just a really, really quick video on the Apple ECG feature. Um, this is exclusive to the Series 4 Apple Watch. So if this is something that is very, very important to you, I would definitely recommend you to upgrade to that Series 4 Apple Watch. Um, it's definitely worth it. Um, it's if you're health conscious, of course, if you're really into your health and wanting to know that stuff. It's definitely a worthy upgrade just for this feature alone. Um, if you guys did like this video, go ahead and like the video. Comment, uh, let me know your thoughts, um, subscribe to the channel. Um, and also guys, we're almost at 100 subscribers. We're so close, we're so close. So, you know, guys, keep subscribing to my channel. I'm appreciating all the support that I'm getting all these videos. Till the next time, guys, my name is Lou Monastan, and I'm out. Peace.